For howl means the cold hole or hollow, also nicknamed Wellington's nose due to its profile from Loch Carron. For howl. Welcome everyone to Corrie Lair in the northwest highlands of Scotland. And following on from my previous video, this beautiful mountain is Fuar Howell, and we're about to find a way to its summit. Having previously been thwarted by the river, the approach was going to have to be different this time. We had decided upon an early start from Achnasialach station. The station, no red torches on. Our route choice was an unorthodox one. By the railway line for a short distance, crossing the burn via the railway bridge, then a steep bash up the lower heather slopes of our mountain. After that, well, who knew? And there's the first glimpse of our first objective. A few years earlier, we had ascended this same peak with our nephew Andrew, followed by an unforgettable traverse of the two neighbouring Munros. That time, we had started from the same place, but then struck a line up a wide, steep and snowy gap which led to the foot of the ridge, to the left of the craggy lower hillside you can see. This time we chose a different route. To find a line. We had spotted a steep looking snowy groove above a series of slabs, which we decided to attempt. It looked steep, but experience dictated that it would appear less so when we reached it. Golden rule, never ascend anything we wouldn't be able to reverse. Fantastic. See below, this is where we got to. And there's five foot light. <laughs> we just come up there. So I see our line of footprint somewhere just in there. And we just come over the, the lip there. Wow, finally on the summit plateau. Four hell. Now, if you had your snowshoes, they'd work on top of this ridge. Inspector. Oh, there it is. Got one. Hey! First rock inspector of the day. If you can make that out. Heading up to the north. Up in the west. South, where we just come up, there's no footprints. Orbit. Fantastic conditions again. such conditions is steep and not obvious, 
so care had to be taken weaving through the boulders on descent. So you come down from there. Well, this is quite a spectacular spot in the Bialak on the other side of Thwarthor after a fairly adventurous climb up. So we just come down there. It's like a frozen arctic wasteland. Everything's glowing. And there's the Munro next to us. That's Gordui. Skorru means red peak and garlic. Lunch, a nice view. And then we're going around there. Just winding our way around the crags and the slabs and just trying to find a good route up the hill. And some magnificent snowy conditions. I'm treading through virgin snow today. I was thinking in it at times. Every time you walk a little further and you just get a most magnificent view and look at that. It's almost like a infinity pool. path anywhere, try and find our best way, looking back to where we've just come from. And you see our line of footprints in the snow. Some days are just worth getting out of bed for. <laughs> wow, look at that. And here's your 360 from Skurui out to the west, Some south. Skurui. We came up before, looking out to the east. Back 
on the last day of 2023, we were remembering the fairly steep descent from Skorui down to the Bialak between it and its neighbouring Munro, Ben Liavor. It's a fairly spicy ridge all of a sudden again. First time with the crampons on this season. It's always a nice moment. Back in 2017 with Andy, we carried on over the second Munro with a head torch finish. This time we had a date with Patrick, Ian and Meg in the pub and we walked back down the outstandingly beautiful Corrie Lair, looking forward to a beer. tower there, just walking out. Let's look at those hills ahead. Sun's setting on them now. Look ahead there, magnificent. Come back to where we were earlier on. Come back to where we've just been. So, I'll share my last sandwich. I'll have a bite, my love. Can you watch? Here we are, back in the forest. Sun's going to be setting soon. Big day out. Well, that's me away again. I hope you've enjoyed sharing the outstanding beauty of Fuahao, Skorui, and the beautiful Corrie Thank you all for watching, and I hope you too have enjoyed the start of 2024. Until next time, cheerio!